rates of work a tank can be filled by tap a in 20 minutes the same tank can be emptied when full in 30 minutes by tap b both taps are turned on at the same time and b turned off of 10 minutes starting with an empty tank find the time taken to fill the tank so we're going to begin by the fraction filled by a because a can fill the tank in 20 minutes so what about in one minute so in one minute a will fill one over 20 of the tank that is a fraction of the tank the same tank can be emptied when full uh, in 30 minutes by b so in one minute b empties this one empties the tank uh, in one minute it will empty one divided by 30 that is a fraction of the tank now both taps are turned on at the same time so when both of them are running so both so both a and b in one minute in one minute what fraction of the tank with the two fill in one minute so we shall take the fraction we used to fill the tank uh, the fraction filled by a which is one divided by 20 and then since b is emptying the tank we are not going to add we are going to subtract so that is the fraction that will fill that will be filled by both a and b so therefore a and b in one minute will fill 1 over 20 minus 1 over 30 which will give 1 over 60 of the tank uh, then we give in this statement both tabs are turned on at the same time and b turn off after 10 minutes b is turned off of 10 minutes so meaning the two tabs a and b are running fast for 10 minutes so uh, we need to ask ourselves if in one minute if in one minute a and b will fill 1 over 60 of the tank what about in 10 minutes what about in 10 minutes so we should just uh cross multiply so 10 multiply by 1 over 60 and these will be 1 over 6 of the tank so both a and b when they are running together they will fill a sixth of the tank so after that uh, b is um, turned off of 10 minutes this is a fraction filled uh, by the two tanks uh, by the two taps that is a and b for 10 minutes so what we need to do is to get the remaining fraction of the tank so assuming that when the tank is full is uh, 6 divided by 6 or 1 and we want to get now the remaining fraction of the tank that is after a and b have filled 1 over 6 of the tank what is remaining so we just need to take full tank which is 6 over 6 or 1 subtract 1 over 6 and so the remaining this is the remaining fraction the remaining fraction to be filled and this fraction is going to be filled by a only since b is turned off so a is the one to fill this so what do you need to do because a is the one that is left uh, running just uh, in one minute uh, so in one minute a fills 1 over 20 of the tank so what about this fraction that is remaining 5 divided by 6 how many minutes will it require so just need to cross multiply so 5 divided by 6 multiply by uh, 20 and these uh, will give by 2 3 by 2 a 10 so this will give 50 divided by 3 so these are minutes these are minutes so this will be 16 minutes 16 and uh, 2 thirds minutes that is the time 
of the meanings taken by A to fill the remaining part of the tank. Now, starting with an empty tank, find the time taken to fill the tank. So from the time it was empty, uh, what is the overall time that has been used to fill the tank? Remember, there was uh, initially 10 minutes that was used by A and B. So you have to add that 10 minutes. Then plus, uh, when A was left alone, that is a 16 and 2 thirds minutes. So total will be 26 and 2 thirds minutes. That is how you're supposed to solve that question. Thank you.